Hey guys, welcome to another episode of Maxi Aspie and today I've got a controversial matter. Is autism a gift or a condition? So throughout my life I've some things I've been really good at and some things I haven't. And some people always like to say that someone with autism was always really good at something. But if we look at the, the grand scheme of things, everybody to a degree is really good at something anyway. So I think some of it becomes more of a shock because, because someone with autism is actually good at something, people then associate it to the condition and go, that's why he's good at it. But if you don't have a condition, we don't make that link. We don't go Ronaldo's good at football because of you know, Leonardo da Vinci was good at painting because of this. So why do we associate when someone is good at something like Bill Gates and go the guy's a genius because he's got autism? Now I don't think that's meant initially or intentionally but I wouldn't say for a minute that my condition makes me better at something or, or that's the reason I'm good at something. But is autism a gift? or is it a condition? And my answer to that is, I believe it can be both. I don't want to change my autism because I think it makes me who I am, and that's a gift in itself. That it makes me who I am, and it's made me the person I am today. It's made me more motivated, more driven. It's put me at, in life at a disadvantage. I've had to work harder to get to where I am today. But then when people say it's a gift, they don't see the impact it has on somebody's life behind the scenes. The stress, the triggers, the environment, the, everything about autism can be so stressful and so disheartening for someone who has it because they blame themselves. And while we see people like Bill Gates, you know, who are geniuses, who then people go, he's got autism, he's got Asperger's, and makes, you know, and that's why he's really good at what he does. At the same time, you don't see what, how it, how it affects people personally behind the scenes. People who go into shops, you know, they say autism is a gift, but some people can't even go into a shop because of the, the environment, the people, the lights, the sensitivity, the sensory issues that come with it. So you've got that aspect of it as well, which I wouldn't say is a gift. It's more of a, a barrier for people. But guys, I want to make this video because I think when people say it's a gift, they don't quite see the reality behind autism, what goes on behind the scenes the stress, the anxiety, the sensory issues, what could what can really affect someone with autism. And I think someone with autism hearing someone go, oh, it's a gift, isn't it? You know, because you're really good at this. You know, that would potentially annoy me. It's not a gift. I don't think it's a bad thing either. But I think just because someone might be good at something, and some people aren't. Some people aren't good at anything. And the one thing that they could be good at is could be something as simple as being kind to someone. So I just think it's about about language and being careful about how we use it. But guys, tell me what you think down below. Tell me your opinion, like the video if you agree, and guys, subscribe to the channel, press that bell notification down below for more future videos on Maxi Aspie. And guys, thank you for watching. Take care and goodbye for now.